All right, hello everybody and welcome back. I am Cassis Plays, and today we are picking up with part two of uh, Police Shootout, the prologue. Still got two more missions open, so uh, I think we're gonna just kind of select one and go right into it. Um, we're just finished up pretty much at the, this parking lot brawl. <laughs> I think we're gonna go into the uh, stalker at the motel. Looks like the other one's a hostage situation. So, let's try that out and see how it goes, I guess. First mission was pretty cool. It was definitely interesting. Um, I wasn't expecting it. I thought it was literally just going to be an easy, like, uh, report. The two guys and the walk away, but that was neat that they uh, kind of threw in a, a more intense situation. All right, report Thomas Jones suspected of stalking his therapist was seen in an area of a motel. The suspect should be brought to police headquarters for questioning involvement in the incident. One person. All right, let's get out. Talk to the motel owner. Someone already called for you. What's going on? I don't know, but I hear loud screams and a woman crying from some motel room, I think. I thought it might be a typical husband-wife brawl. You know, the food wasn't to his liking or something. But then I remember that two women have been kidnapped in the area. I'm glad someone called you. You better check it out. Do you know which room? I don't room? know for sure, but I think it's more like the other end of the building. Alright, I'll have a look. Okay, so... Basically, somewhere around here. Yeah, let me just snoop through some windows. Open the window. I can just go around opening windows here. Uh, was that the motel owner? Or is that just a guy? I think it was just a guy sitting in the chair. Honestly, the game does look pretty good. I mean, whatever engine they're using, it's decent. Here's the, uh, here, let's go talk to the motel owner. I'm guessing. Yeah, yeah, what's going on? Why are you questioning my guests? What are you, what? Ah, uh, good morning, sir. Officer Scott Price. Great, another Price. You're going to bring me bad luck, too? What are you talking about? Is there anyone here with the same name, a man? Yeah, there was this guy. Let me say. Jack Price. I took pity on him because he was broke. Let him spend the night here on the couch. For free. But the bastard, before he ran off first thing in the morning, lifted my phone and all the cash I kept here. Lesson for me, huh? Do you know him? No, you don't know where he is now. I don't know, and I don't want to know. I can't help you. Don't ask any of the other guests either, because I'm sure none of them saw him. Back to the case. All right. Uh, Thomas Jones, does the name ring a bell? Thomas. Yeah. Yeah, unfortunately, I know who. Did he cause any problems? He got drunk, made a ruckus in the pub next door, then came to me and threatened to get my daughter if I talked to the police. He's a fucking freak. I didn't care that much for his talk, but you know, he made my blood boil a little. Okay, what room can I find him in? Room one on the first floor. He sits there all day. I don't think he goes outside. I saw that he came in with some woman. Either that's his wife or, well, you understand. Besides the room he's in, he's paid for another one. Getting a he lot of clues from bonus, this guy. So <laughs> I didn't go into why he needed two rooms. Right, let's confirm it's definitely him. Confirm it. I have his personal information. I took it off his ID. Apart from the fact that he was a troublemaker and threatened you, can you tell me anything about him? I don't think so. Okay. I need to get this man to the police station. Give me the access code to his room. I'm not going to ask for a warrant because he's obviously got a lot on his plate. Get him out of here. The code's 14452. 14452. Hopefully we can uh, remember that. Alright, I have information for another motel guest that he heard screaming and crying like someone was abusing a woman. Any idea who and what room that might be? Um, you know this is a motel, right? A cheap motel. It's where people come to do all kinds of weird shit and yell a little too. Okay. <laughs> I mean, not wrong. All right, let's report this. Report arrival. 
Now he's being treated for depression, but went off his meds, and therefore, according to his therapist, the mood swings. He insisted that she was the only one who understood him. He began stalking her. Suspect's data. We don't have him on file. I don't think he's ever done anything wrong in the past. Except a speeding ticket. Alright. Notebook. Doesn't look like he lets me into his back room. Yes? What is it? So I'm trying to determine. I'll ask you a few questions. Do you mind? Today, yesterday, the last few days, any disturbing events during what the time? Exactly are you asking? Your clients, none of them have been acting strangely, suspiciously, no Other senseless than brawls. Drunk and fooling around. Nothing important. Yeah? Anything else? Uh, Thomas Jones, do you recognize the man? He's staying at the hotel next door. I hear he's been giving you problems. Don't even remind me. He came in with his wife, but they don't seem to be getting along very well. I think, you know, he's got a heavy hand. He usually orders food to the room. Last time he came in here, he drank a lot and spilled his guts. Just telling me how fucked up his wife is. What exactly, and what, when was it exactly, and what did he say? Do you remember? About two days ago. I remember that someone on TV was talking about the disappearance of these two girls in the neighborhood. Terrible thing. And what did he say? First, he hurled at his father the accusation that because of his financial scams, they had lost their house and their life savings. They were left with nothing. Then the old man ended up in jail. I think. That very thing. Left the kids and the wife with nothing. What else? He talked a lot about some doctor. A therapist, I think, who he was obviously in love with. He wasn't necessarily in love with him. He said it was his wife's fault and he had to pay for it. I remember rather well. Yeah. Damn, this guy has a lot of information. Holy crap. That Jones is ordering food to his room tonight, yeah. too. The kitchen's in the middle of cooking his order. I want Jones to pick it up as soon as I call him. Yeah? Ooh. Anything else? Thank you for the information. Wow, that's a lot. Holy crap. Father's problems. He was in, uh, His father was in prison for embezzlement. Let's see what we got for reporting it in. Questions about the wife. Jones is abusing his wife. Sure, I'll check. Wait a minute, I got good looks. Uh, looks like there's. it's not the first time. She's been to the ER a few times. Contusions, bruises, her, my tests. No information, nothing at all. Guess the neighbors report her brawls at their house. Information has been reported. Okay. I don't know if you have to look at your notepad every time something new opens um where does this wait why is there huh a little weird the bathroom door has a door that leads to uh, <laughs> that okay well we know where the first date is at that's good All right, let's see what we got here. Find the suspect. I mean, I could go question all of them, but he said that they are ordering food. Do we know what room he was in? Again? Uh, he orders often. So technically we can uh, act like we're Room number one, the motel's first floor. Oh, wait, he's literally right here. Wait, that's two, three, four, five. Oh, room one is up there. Oh no, it looks like a mess.
Take it easy. No sudden movements. Put the gun down and let's talk. Let's talk. Yeah, sure. Why should I talk to you? Because that might be your last chance. Uh, takes his frustration out. Where is my the good arguments? Three out of five. Oh no. The three out of out of all of these are good. Two of them are bad. Um, so I can get one hint. The wife keeps giving him one last chance. This one has the most information. What's this one? Okay, bad. Do not use that one. He's obsessed. Wait, I can use another hint? This one has most of the information missing, missing. Try this. Good, he's obsessed with his victim. I know you expected something different that she kicked you out. You felt like somebody kicked you in the balls, but don't believe, I don't believe you want to hurt her. It's not too late, put the gun down. We'll find your way out. What's the way out? There's no way out. No way out. <laughs> no, you won't forget. Think you're only one who comes who feels misunderstood and rejected. You scared the shit out of that woman by coming up into her life. Know what they do to people like you in prison. Do you really want to end up like that? I don't want to, but it's it's too late, okay? Perfectly chosen argument. Oh my god. Wait, we can actually handcuff him right now? Alright. Nice. Wow, look at that. Okay. Well, let me grab the handcuffs first. Hold E to handcuff. Suspect arrested. Oof. Okay, let me report it. Suspect neutralized. Copy that. I know my rights. I won't say anything. You will, you will at the police station. Even the mute starts singing. Okay. Damn. Oh my god. Wait, why is this two rooms? It's literally two rooms. It must got a like nice upgrade. Is it over? Is it over? Have you taken care of him? You're safe now. Tell me what's going on with the other woman. Promised to kidnap that therapist of his. He said he was keeping her somewhere close. He's been looking into her, but I don't know if she's at the motel or somewhere else. You have to find her. Of course, there's a second part to this. Black cell finder, don't worry, just calm down, alright? Okay, radio it in, hostage safe. Good job, thanks. Medical record, suspect's wife's medical rec records clearly show he is violent, violent towards her. Hey. Somebody keeps walking in and out somewhere. Find the second hostage. Where did you put her? Where's the other woman? We're going to find her one way or another, with or without your help. You want to get yourself a longer sentence? Go ahead and don't talk. Damn, he really wants a long sentence. Okay. He didn't want to die, but... But he was like, uh-uh. Are there any other rooms that are like an absolute mess? Find the second hostage. Said, I don't know if she's here or in another room. Let me ask this guy. What's that noise up there? Thomas Jones, we talked about him. He's responsible for the kidnapping and two women. One of them is his wife. I found. Do you know any idea where the other one is? Shit, so he's a complete nutcase. 
Check out room number three downstairs. That's the other rooms Jones rented. Here's the key. Nice. Yeah. Sh room number three. Oh, three. Wait, why are you sitting out in front of this room? Item secured, the key, key to the vehicle. Weapons and cash. Secure what you can. Key to room three on the first floor, key to the vehicle. Oh no, what if she's inside of it? Which one's his vehicle? And did you find the other up? Still looking. How do I know which one's his vehicle? Um, uh, I wonder when we get a stun gun, or maybe it's like an upgrade. Wait, which one's actually his vehicle? <laughs> Is there like a creepy one? Don't tell me he drives this car. It's just a toilet setting back here. Can I ask him? Maybe I can ask him what, what uh, vehicle he drives. I know my rights. I won't say anything. All right, fine. Don't say anything. I'm not saying another fuck you. Fine, fine, fine. We can I actually I can load checkpoint. So technically if you fail out on something you can I guess reload it. Wait, who are you then? Is it? Is something wrong? There's a woman being held in a room upstairs. It turns out the man is responsible for the kidnapping. Did you see anything? I can't believe it. It's the guy from room I ran yes. into him from time to time because he was out smoking. He was hanging around the bar a little bit too, and I once heard him discussing his truck with another hotel guest. That man had already checked out, but I remember that was the case. She must be around here somewhere. I saw her once, smaller, white, I think. Then she did in fact disappear, but if the man's still here, I have no idea. So his truck might not actually be here. It sounds like it might be over at the bar. Suspects was often seen as this truck. Maybe we can find another hostage there. Police, what's the matter? You remember seeing a white truck? Yeah, I saw one. I think the guy from room one parked it behind that diner next to the motel. But what exactly? They're always yelling. Well, they run <laughs> yes. out. Lady, ma'am, ma'am, please give me some space, ma'am. I'm trying to do some work here, ma'am. I am. Okay. Carry on, man. He tr parked it behind. Are you saying that his truck is here? Behind the motel. Oh, wait. What if it's in the back? Oh, wait. I saw a truck, if I remember correctly. There was one. Wait, is this his truck? No way. Why would he have... Uh, uh oh. What are we about to walk into? Oh god. Oh, at last. I was so afraid that crazy man would leave me here. Why wasn't she screaming? I only have a few bruises, but it's, it's nothing serious. And he, Thomas, how is he? And his wife, is she alright? Oh my lord. New assignment. Second hostage has been rescued. Can I grab him? I know my rights. I That's fine, we found her. Saying another word would fuck you. <laughs> okay. Don't 
don't waste any time. You have to find her. Find your husband's therapist. She's safe. Oh, really? That's wonderful. What if she's in on this whole thing? Why do I feel like there's going to be more? There's something I'm, I'm probably missing. Mission. Suspects arrested. Pulled out the handcuffs to arrest your opponent. Wait, two. Wait, can I arrest her too? Should I arrest her too? Don't waste any time. You are rich. I guess not. How do I put my hands back? Put it away. <laughs> Okay. Return to the police car. I wonder if we have to go down to the station and like interrogate him there. Continue the mission or complete it? Wait, I hit continue. Um I guess there's nothing else. Let's it let's it complete then. 92%. What did I miss out on? Uh, that radio reports 6 out of 10. Suspects killed. No penalties. Okay. I guess there are some things I didn't uh, report in. Do you need to relax while traveling or maybe to hide the police? From the police because you have a guilty conscience. It's a new ad for motel where two kidnapped women were how long ago. One of them was a kidnapper psycho psychotherapist. Oh my god. Police officer nominated as local Herlock Sh Herlock Sholmes. Nice. Nice. Uh okay. Reduce noise while moving at first. I feel like negotiations is like the most critical thing. Because if you don't get the negotiations right, then like everything goes to like, yeah, having nice, unless if you want to fight every conversation. Um, opponents need more time to detect you. It shows how many tasks have not been found. Wait, really? At first, you get a bonus for uh, setting up a suspect. During the negotiation, you get points for the suspect's attitude. I have two, so I can do one and one. Keep going. All right, the last thing we have is the hostage situation. And because of that, I guess we'll go into that for uh, for this one here. Why not, right? Why not? Police shootout. This video is only like 23 minutes or so, so I might as well just start the next. But I'm gonna have to pause for myself, but you guys won't see a difference. Alright, so we are on site at this area uh, for the gas station robbery, it looks like. Hostage situation probably the owner of the station who reported it, wounded civilian, the attackers are extremely aggressive. Involved in an incident, probably two people. Probably. Okay. Sure. <laughs> Go ahead and uh, find out what the. Alright, let's report it. I was the one who called. Uh, Are you yes, hurt? Alright, let's call it in. Send an ambulance now. All right, let's see what information we can find out from over here. You're probably here about what happened at the neighbors? No, I, I heard, I think I heard gunshots and people screaming, but when I came out the garage, it was quiet. Guys, that means there's something much bigger going on at the station after all. We heard the police sirens. Uh, are you... No, no, no. Uh, we have a lot of work to do. 
very vaguely. But that's everything. Okay. Then I don't really even know much. Uh, what about this guy? Wait, wait. Uh, di didn't you happen to be involved in that last operation at the uh, supermarket? Oh, yeah, that was me. I heard about you. Uh, m my wife was there with her daughter. Ah. Uh. You know, I usually go shopping alone, but uh, thanks, okay, that that you uh, you took out the bad guys? It's it's a mess, huh? The uh, That guy, the, the one that got away. Uh, I, I didn't see much. I, uh, I heard the roar of gunfire and the, the screams of people. I mean, I, I may have seen them, but how was I supposed to know it was them? You know? They, 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 um, <laughs> they didn't write I... cigarette, that, <laughs> as you can see. Uh, I'm taking a break from my drive. I just, uh, you're stubborn, but, but I know it's... Okay. Oh, there's a guy. Great. Right. Well, Drop your weapon and surrender. I'm not taking the rep for this mess. Not happening. I will say it again. Drop the gun and surrender now. You're alone. I'll shoot you and run. How about that? Great. Oh my god. Suspect was killed. other this person always just standing here i don't know how to thank you i thought this crazy lunatic will find me yes i was taking out the trash when all this started i heard gunshots and screaming so i immediately hid behind this bus i was so scared i'm fine thanks to you who knows what could have happened if I don't even want to think about it. Not this one here, but the other one, yeah, I know him. I've seen him here more than once. This is Bob, Bob Smooth, brother of the girl who worked with us until recently. We even became friends, me and this girl. I know she had an affair with her boss, and I... Bob hung around me at one point. We even went out for drinks a few... I don't like narcissists. And he... he loved to brag. He <laughs> talked about those cards all the time. She no longer works with us. He treated her Bob's furious. I've never seen him like this. Suspect was looking for the owner. Okay. She gave us a good amount of information at least. Records confirmed that the suspect had never been involved in a similar operation before. So they're amateur. Great. Uh now we have to figure out a way out to get in. Closed.
Um, we can't like turn off the power, can we? That'd be cool. Maybe there's something in this shed or whatever this is. Hey, okay, nothing, nothing. About this guy, let's ask him real quick. I'm very glad that you came, but wait, no, some, I've been working, I went out for a smoke, a robbery happened, what, the one I know is probably, yeah, that white SUV, do you see it, to the right of the entry, security, no security, yes, a robbery, the one I know is probably, that's right, two, two, go no, I'm sorry, I'm never, Okay, so we got two suspects. That's the vehicle. Uh, no security, but there is cameras. Suspect's car. Car was stolen. All right, we should probably take care of this situation. New assignment. Find a way to open the, the station. Great. Uh, we can't find a way in. We really have a lot of work to do. Oh, only that I think someone will... Ellie, get off your ass and hit. What? No, 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 no. I've been... Wait, what do you say? Station locked. The front door to gas station is locked. Oh, uh, that's just saying that locked for us. Um, crap. That's closed too. Oh, that's a lot. I was like, what the heck is that noise? Maybe I can ask him if we can see the cameras. Dude, I don't know. Can't jump. All the windows are locked. Distract the suspect. A lot of noise has to be made to divert the suspect's attention. You mean all the gunshots that I made earlier or took earlier weren't enough noise? <laughs> Maybe if I hit his car. I'll hold down to sound the alarm. Nothing. Brenda's dead out back here. Come on, there's got to be something. Something we can try. <laughs> Authorized use of a weapon. Can I start setting off other car alarms? 
find a way to open the station. Unless if it like got bugged or something. And I was supposed to walk around the front. Uh, hurts like hell. Yes. Uh, I was trying. Yeah. 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 The second guy got real. Uh, maybe they just wanted to scare everyone. Two of them. Yeah. The girl has to be found. Thank you. One of them is very aggressive. The hoodlum, uh, the other hoodlum's the quiet guy. Girl ran away. Order this to be found to bring the girl who escaped and uh, witness. Okay. That's more info. Are you the girl that ran away? Is there something else I can do to help you? I'm listening. Front door is blocked and so is back door. Is there any way? So, but you know what? My brother Daniel works in the garage next door. You'll know him instant. Please tell him I sent you. I'll open the gate so you can sneak around the back of the station. Wow. Okay. Thank you, lady. Very kind of you. Brother in the workshop. Witness brother who works in the garage may be able to open the station door for us. Everybody knows each other, I guess. Are you her brother? Yes. Anything else? No. If that's every How about you? Maybe it's this guy. I swear, if it's the owner, we, we, Eli. Only that I think. Ellie, get off your ass! What? No, 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 no. Oh my God. It is the guy at the front. It is him, sir. You're probably here about what happened at the neighbor. You make keys what? and you wouldn't tell me. What? What do you mean? Was she working today? She what do you mean? To be off. In the back of the station, she's know. fine. Yes, I do. Sally was telling me a little. This girl came to me and asked for a loan. This whole mess. Sally said he took great. Yeah, we talk a lot. <laughs> Let the front door is operated by the fuse box. It's outside. I can get it to you in just a sec. You're a good thinker. Let me help. Nice. You're a good thinker, eh? Well, I didn't get the job for nothing, right? I would hope. This kind of reminds me of the, there's a game called Accident where you have to like be the detective for accidents that happen. Um, I never played it before, but I remember watching uh, actually Lyric play it, and it was it looked pretty cool. Kind of reminds me of that. Always wanted to play it sometime. There he is. I think you just open the front door. Yeah, I'm waiting for him to turn around. I might be able to knock him out when he's right there. Got him. There it is. Free the station owner. Suspect in custody. I'm not talking to you. I'm up shit creek anyway. An item was secured. Police? Does that mean it's over? What actually uh, happened here? I'm almost losing my life. It seems the girl I recently fired from her job didn't take it too well. Uh, her 
charming brother pretty much proved that to us today. Ah, I see. You think that uh, that was the reason your affair with the girl and an unplanned pregnancy has nothing to do with That's it? That's not necessarily your business, is it? How, how'd you figure that? I'd be the boss of the mother of my child? Yes? I'm all right, but if it wasn't for you, things could have been different. Thank you. The doors are... The doors are already open. Wait, what happened to the little girl, though? Uh, we still have to find the girl. Okay. That's all good there. <sighs> Back to the police car. Girl who ran away is to be found. He ordered his partner to find and bring the girl who escaped. Is she the girl? Was she the girl that escaped? Wait, wait. Uh, did I heard about you know? Thanks. Okay. It's it's a. Uh, I I, I can't get out of the conversation now. Uh, I'm smoking a cigarette. That as you can see. Well, you. Ah, uh, here we go. You did a. Did it work? I think she is the girl. I think our I think our job is done here. Just about here. Let me check the notebook mission. Uh, go back to the police car. Talk to the witness. Find a way to open the store. Get the victim help. Suspects killed. One ran away. Nice. Go ahead and complete the mission. Completed 86%. Uh, you, we got 5% penalty because of the uh, the kill. Suspects arrested. We only got one because we killed one. Radio reports. We missed one radio report. And now for the news. Cupid's arrow straight in the heart of a wounded witness to a gas station robbery. The man was almost in very serious condition when the ambulance arrived at the scene. Under the influence of strong pain medication, he professed his love to both paramedics who attended to him. At the hospital, his condition stabilized, but his love for all the nurses in the ward did not go away. The owner of the gas station literally has a bullseye on his back, literally. The woman's heartbreaker finally fell into a love trap. His last love turned out to be a way, base, way off base. The brother of the girl, whom the pickup artist Charmed with his original beauty only to eventually break her heart, took matters into his own hands. On the behalf of the editorial team, we would like to thank the brother for his proper civic attitude. A woman frightened of fair police on duty, she faces up to two years in prison for this. The officer in conversation wait, what? Frightened a policeman on duty? Wait, what? Okay. Thank you for playing Prologue, and that's it. That's uh, the Police Shootout Prologue. Very interesting. Uh, yeah, I'm kind of excited for the for the full game. I think it should be a good time. Uh, but yeah, that's going to be it for pretty much this video. So if you guys enjoyed it, definitely leave a like. The first part is already out at this point as well. So if you want to check out the beginning, feel free to do that. Uh, subscribe for more and hopefully I will see you guys in the next one. All right, peace out. Have a good one and goodbye.